Boom, another day, another test. Welcome to Rampage. Welcome to this Rampage. I don't know if you can see me very well. I have light here. I have light here. No, you cannot see it. Anyway, this week's Rampage was a preparation for a good collision, if I can say this. I didn't have any expectations because, honestly, how can you have expectations for Rampage? Anyway, the start is start with Santana versus Ortiz. Basically, this is a feud that I feel like if they gave to Santana or Ortiz a little bit more time, a little bit more screen time every week, a little bit more time on Dynamite, a little bit more time on Collision, it would have been awesome. Like, they have needed nothing else. Like, the match itself was great. Santana won and I don't know what does that mean for the whole feud but I was a little bit upset because I was seeing this feud progressing only over Rampage and that was all that was all for that feud next up we had a Kenny Omega versus MJF promo because on Dynamite we saw that MJF is about to become the longest reigning champ so Kenny Omega was like I have the right to defend my streak so basically on collision we're gonna have a match mjf versus kenny omega streak versus title kind of match i'm really excited to see this at this promo segment at the end of the kenny omega part jay white came out and he was talking a little bit of a shtick because he was like maybe uh, i'm gonna defend the title uh from you kenny because uh, now the title is with me, not with MJF, uh, a little bit of a nonsense, but on the MJF side, Don Callis came out and he was like, you can join the family. MJF was like, that's so cool, if I join your family, maybe one day I'm gonna become champion. Oh, oh, wait, I don't need your help. So basically this segment was really cool. After that, we had a fatal four-way match, Sky Blue versus Willow Nightingale versus Anna J versus Abaddon. And um, I was hoping a little bit Sky Blue to win, but maybe I'm rushing a little bit because the winner of that match is gonna face the AEW World Champion. Maybe it's not the right time for Sky Blue, but yeah, maybe it's not the right time for Willow as well. So basically, the real fight was between Anna J and Abaddon, even though I have never seen Abaddon in my life. And my only suspicion is that she won because it's Halloween season. But I don't know, that's just a speculation. I also have the speculation that there is a spider here. Wait, wait, I need, maybe, maybe, or just a hair, I don't know, I'm not sure. Mm, spoopy season. But as I said, Abaddon won that match and she's gonna face on collision Hikaru Shida for the AEW Women's Championship. Last but not least, the main event of the Rampage, Kyle Fletcher versus cannot stay Takeshita, hope I didn't butcher your name Takeshita, I know you're watching these videos, I'm sorry. Uh, it was good, it was actually pretty good, of course, Kyle Fletcher lost, but at the end, Kyle Fletcher came to the ring with the chair and he started attacking the family uh, of Don Callis, and basically at some point Don Callis was like, stop, don't attack him guys, because course everyone started to attack him back Don Callis all of a sudden decided he wants Kyle Fletcher in the family because he uh, saw that hate in his eyes with his with the chair in his arms and all of that stuff so yeah now apparently Kyle Fletcher is in the Don Callis family I don't know what does that mean we're gonna see probably on Dynamite but we will see and I was wondering why Don Callis is going and recruiting everyone in the entire roster the Kyle Fletcher versus the Keshta match would have been 10 times bigger if instead of having two minutes here, two minutes there, two minutes here, two minutes there, trying to recruit people in his family, he can promote how Kyle Fletcher was a piece of shit and garbage and all of that stuff. And because Kyle Fletcher is objectively good, the Keshta is good, and I think that match was underselled, in my opinion. So, yeah. With that being said, if I was rating Rampage, I would have given it 6 out of 10. A little bit of a slow, low score, but uh, maybe next week we're gonna have a better Rampage. 
I hope I motivate you, Mr. Tony Khan, for better booking or whoever books the show. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm going to see you tomorrow with the Collision review. Honestly, I have already watched Collision and I'm pretty hyped to see what you guys think. And yeah, I, I was super excited to see all the matches and I'm not going to spoil anything. Peace.